Good morning, good afternoon, or whenever you're listening to this video. My dear brothers and sisters, delegates to the General Conference, I greet you in the name of our Lord and Savior, Jesus the Christ. Thank you for taking the time to listen to this short video. My name is Earl J. Griffin Sr., an aspirant for the office of Bishop. I am 66 years of age, a faithful, fearless, fruitful member of the Christian Methodist Episcopal Church. This election is pivotal. It will undoubtedly set the stage for the growth and stability of our Zion for years to come. I care. I'm holding on to my faith that God is not finished with the Christian Methodist Episcopal Church. Yes, we have challenges. Yes, we need to embrace a period of reformation and confrontation, a quadrennial where the needs of our members trump any individual or selfish ambitions of our leaders. It is time to put God and God's people at the top of our priorities. Change is necessary. Yes, beloved, change is coming. Your vote is critical in this process. And I'm asking, humbly asking for your vote. A vote for Earl J. Griffin Sr. is a vote for someone who will speak truth to power, challenge the college to elevate their thinking, and collegially help the bishops do what is best for this church. God has called you as a delegate to vote, to be led by his spirit and the sage wisdom of your spiritual leaders in your decision for three candidates and possibly an indigenous candidate for the 10th Episcopal District. Please pray and fast for the strength to make the best choice among us candidates. We are CME. I am CME, and I wish to serve as a bishop. But if not, serve, I will. I believe that God is calling me to this position for such a time as this. My experience as the president, presiding elders council, presiding elder in the Louisiana region, annual conference in the fourth Episcopal district and a longstanding pastor and leader in this church. These experiences I will use to embrace the challenges of the office of bishop. So I ask for your support. For more information, you may visit my website, drearlgriffin.com. You may also reach out to me with any questions you may have by phone or email. Just know that I am approachable. I stand ready to talk with you or your group at any time. My platform is simple. Address the needs and challenges that face our church and make the necessary changes to allow us to meet the needs of God's people in this present age. And so my dear delegates, I'm asking God to bless and keep you, to protect you. I'm looking forward to seeing you at the General Conference in Cincinnati to shake your hand, to speak with you, to clarify any misconceptions or misunderstandings you may have concerning my candidacy. But what I am actually looking for in June of 2022 is a move of God through your votes as delegates to turn this old ship of Zion northward toward the city of God, being a church of liberation and transformation and formation to help to elevate a people through education, not only Christian education, 
but any other field of education through service in the world and to give our children hope, to give our children a reason to keep on achieving great and outstanding service in the world. I want you to know that Marilyn and I are asking for your support. We are trying to earn your votes, earn your consideration. We do not take you for granted and we're reaching out to you now. Pray about this decision. And I pray that God will lead you to embrace me as one of the next bishops in the Christian Methodist Episcopal Church. God bless you and God keep you is my prayer. We love you and we're praying for you in Jesus name, amen.